and Nightside Project. Finish the day happy, happy with Ethan Millard and Alex Carey on KSL News Radio. Okay, I'm gonna hit one. Over the weekend was the NBA All Star Game. We got hit with a tweet on this one. Okay, and I loved it because I watched it. You know, the NBA All Star Game is. Do you know if you win the NBA All Star Game, you get 50 grand? Okay. Do you? If you lose, you get 25 grand. Still, everybody wins <laughs> in that situation, right? Everybody wins everybody somewhere wins. around a fifth of what they would earn if they'd played yeah. a normal game. So there's this shot that's surrounding the uh, – that's, that's kind of floating around out there. Jack Canyon sent this to us. Jack, appreciate the tweet, bro. And I love this picture. Uh, it's all of the All-Stars, the Western All-Stars, all lined up. It's during the National Anthem. You see the flag in the back, and you see all the players standing there. And they all kind of are the, – the move for the NBA player is to stand there, kind of legs shoulder width uh, apart – and hands either in your warm-up pockets or behind your back and kind of head down. like, And they kind of do the shake back and forth thing. So everybody's standing there. The national anthem's going. Yeah. One player has his hand over his heart. Utah Jazz power forward or shooting guard. Uh, John Stockton. Is he a small forward? What would, what would Gordon Hayward do? Small forward, right? Uh, Gordon Hayward. Right in the middle of everybody. Lone guy with his hand on his heart. Good for him. During the national anthem, and then that doesn't mean that everybody else is like protesting amid 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 visceral protests at the NBA All Star Game by other players. One player stands up, and you know everybody reads into it like, you know why? It's because he's a tr- dang Trump supporter. And then other people are like, well, you know why? It's because he doesn't hate America. And it's like, no, it's somewhere in between of hey. Somebody still holds their hand over their heart during the national anthem. Yeah. Well, there are a lot of ways to do it, though. The uh, You can hold a plastic hand over it. No, you no, can no, 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 no. Um, make we, a balloon hand. We kind hand. of all do the hand over the heart, but do you have you ever heard of the Bellamy salute? The Bellamy salute was the way that Bill Bellamy? you did it. Here, I'll show you a photo of the Bellamy salute. Oh. All right. Ethan's going to pull up a picture of the Bellamy uh, well, salute. Well, the Bellamy salute is interesting um because what happens is the move is this you bring your hand up to your chest and then you bring it out palm forward and hold it at arm's length just about shoulder height huh so so if you think about what that looks like i put the photo up here for your enjoyment oh the bellamy <laughs> the bellamy salute is it essentially is, the it, nazi salute it is a nazi salute but with a hand turned right no it's those are just kids not doing it really oh. quickly oh but uh, no, no. Uh, I, you, it looks like they're reaching out to shake the hand of the flag, kind of. They're you, all hey. You bring your hand up to your heart, and then you, and then you, and then you draw it outward with the palm down, Ye- out towards the flag. Yeah, it's straight up. It's the straight up. Yeah. It's Sieg Heil stuff. Yeah. Let's not do the Bellamy salute. So there are a lot of ways that we used to do this. Now I'll give you to our here's credit a pop to quiz. these kids' credit. This was definitely 19. Well, look at how many stars are on the flag. Half uh, a dozen. Uh, <laughs> Half a dozen. You know the old, you know, <laughs> the strong six, they called them back then. I guess they were never before the, than 13. It was before the 13 colonies rolled up. There were these six. You just can't see very And it was many. just it's Mike, really Craig, Fred, <laughs> Albert. And Sean, and they were just strong dudes who put their own states together. Uh, pop quiz. And then quiz. they saluted with the Nazi salute to the flag. Pop U.S. history quiz. Yeah. When do you think the U.S. stopped using the Bellamy salute? Uh, 1937. Somewhere around the Nazis, yeah, you, yeah. you'd guess correctly. Yeah. But, uh, well, so, in fairness geez. to the NBA players, the tradition is to hold your hand over Again. the heart, but it's there are actually multiple ways of doing this, and there have always been different ways of doing it.